All right, so welcome back. <clears throat> uh, I, I, my mic should be fixed now. Uh, that shouldn't be an issue anymore. Uh, yeah, the gain on my mic was way, way, way too loud. Uh, but you know, shit happens. Deliver the letter to Machiavelli near the Terme di Treno. What's that? Is that a is that a wolf? A dog? A fox, perhaps? Who the hell is this guy? What the fuck? What? Rex, bro. What the fuck are those guys? You know what I want to use? I want to use the little bag. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's how we do it. Where did these murderers come from? I don't know. They must have come from in here. Sure, why not? That doesn't make any sense, but Oh yeah, I guess there's a there's a wolf head in there. Are they Templars or are they are they Wolfman Templars? I guess we'll we'll figure it out pretty soon. Yeah, I've never been so in advance in an LP. I keep the shrine to Romanus. Guess I need to go up there. Okay, and I need to go up there too. Romulus, if you're uh, if you're history retarded, is uh, is uh, I believe he is one of the. Uh, okay. Uh, he is is a legend, I believe. Uh, yeah, it's a legend. Guess it's not a true story. I uh, basically he was a dwarf and Romulus and uh, what's the name of the other one? Ah, oh, gosh, I don't remember. Uh, but yeah, basically they're twins or brothers, and uh, they uh, they were left abandoned and they were uh, they were breastfeeded by a uh, by uh, by a wolf, and they they decided to start Rome. And basically, long story short, in a power struggle, uh, the Romulus's brother killed him. Killed, Rom killed Romulus, and then he, uh, because he felt bad for him, you know, murdering his uh, his little brother, I believe, he uh, he named the city Rome. I believe, I believe some of that is historically correct. Uh, don't quote me on that though. I believe I got some part of it right. Probably not. A lot of it right there. Uh, where do I need to go? Not there, Jim. Not there. Um. I'm up on that. Let's make that jump. That's not the way either. Fuck. Uh. <clears throat> Yeah, so that's a, that's a pretty cool story. Uh. There we go. There we go.
But yeah, I think I'm gonna need to hurry things up a bit, cause I mean, we're all, it's already, I think it's episode 7 now, right now. And, uh, I mean, we haven't, we haven't officially eliminated anybody. Also, I guess that's why they were wearing, uh, wearing uh, Really don't turn to afraid of anything, Ezio. <coughs> you really aren't afraid of anything. Yo, where they at? Where they at? That's, that's cool. That doesn't do anything for me though. Uh, there we go. There we go. So I think this is a really neat little way that I found to, uh, to edit and, uh, Record all my shit from now on. Yeah, game, I know. It's like the 12th time you explain me that mechanic. Uh, where do I need to go? Do I need to swing on that? Can I jump to that? Oh, yeah, apparently I can. Wow. Isn't that convenient? Isn't that just a very convenient? What is in here? I really, I really, really enjoy uh, that the time period uh, in which this takes place, you know, right after, uh, right when the Roman Empire was just at, at its full power. Uh, well, not you know, this is not the time period exactly. It's the Renaissance. It's after that, but holy shit, where? Uh, I guess I need to climb up here then. Oh well, it just the file a statue then. But yeah, uh, that time period, like right after the the Greek Empire fell, you know the Greek the Greek times where where all that sweet ass mythology was uh was done. Uh, that that's really one of my favorite uh favorite part in uh, in history. I can't make that jump. I need to go back. Maybe climb down. Oh well, no. I just fell through the, the fire of hell. It's okay though. No. It's okay. We'll find a way. We'll find a way. <coughs> if I if Ezio could climb that, that'd be real fancy too. Let's see. There is a thing there that I probably can go loot. I'm not interested in that. So you know we're gonna take a fat chance with that uh, with that jump right there. We're gonna take a fat chance, see if uh That's 
not what I meant to do, but... Okay. No, that's not what I meant to do, but... Because I know that we're most definitely on the right way. I mean, there's, n there's no chance that we're not on the right path there. It's impossible. Oh well, looks like looks like my first in instinct was right. Come on, Edia, hurry it up a bit. Don't have all day. We don't have all day, buddy. I love how everything is just conveniently placed for us to be able to do to do things like that. I mean, I love. Don't get me wrong. I love the SNK series, but to me, it's just, yeah, it's always been uh, kind of uh, kind of off-putting about the whole thing. It takes away from the realism of it. Again, I feel like a giant douchebag for making realism complaints in a game where my guy can literally see through the walls. But you know. What's up? What's in there? Oh my god. Yo. That guy is cray cray. They're all probably great, great. I love Ezio's face. It's just like, what the fuck did I get myself into? What the fuck did I get myself into? You don't need to jump in the air for no for no reason. Uh, how do I get there, though? Climb up here. Oh, there we go. Didn't know why I didn't do that the first time. Ah, oh, fuck you. Nobody now I can there. get back up here. Okay, well, that's convenient. Right? Very convenient again. You know, who am I to... Who am I to whine about convenience? Okay, uh, what I do now... Climb on top of that. I sure can.
could help if I fall. I won't fall. I'm Audio Auditore della Firenze. I never fall. I never fall. Okay, what I do now is I record for five hours and I render all my five videos at the same time. Uh, even though it takes a bit longer than recording them one by one. Then I mean after that I can like what I do is I start the I start the render. Uh, like through there I guess. Yeah, I I start the render. Then after that I Oh god. Wow, wow. Perfect. A route up if I fall. That couldn't have been more convenient. Well played, Ubisoft. Well played. I guess that's where we need to go. Hopefully nobody catches me stealing all their shit. I mean, I'm gonna kill them if they do, but... That'd just be a real awkward uh, encounter. Like, what the fuck are you doing here, mate? Oh, nothing. I'm just... You know taking all of your belongings for my own for my own gain what is that? Scroll of Rimulus I leave my family armor here one of the finest sets ever made may who find it with strength in battle Change of running. We've taken it and set it back behind the iron door. Six keys unlocked. It's spread among our brother. It shall be. It shall be said to come from Romulus, and they will worship it. Okay. So it's kind of like the Altair armor in uh in the the second one. Okay. Is that that's fine. Probably gonna do that at five if we have time later on. Okay, I'm really enjoying this game so far. Uh, you know, it's uh, it's The followers nice. of Romulus. This band of false pagans has been terrorizing the city for months and driving the people into the arms of the church. Quite convenient. Exactly. I believe the Borgia are supporting them, but proof remains scarce. That is why the letter is so important. Here it is. I hope you can break a cipher. Cazzo! Another encryption! This one was supposed to be legible. They are transmitting them using a code sheet. Without it, we have nothing. Sometimes logic is not the only <coughs> way to win a war. Antiamo! You said we had allies in the city. Bring me to them. Yeah, bring me to them. Follow me. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to follow him again. He walks at literally 0 0.5... 0 0.5 mile an hour. Okay, are we gonna talk or are we just gonna walk in silence the whole way? But yeah, uh, I am...